Busy day for those folks having to clean up a lot, I huh? I know, those Broward people dealing with a lot. And here's video this noon from when the tornado actually touched down near Broward College's north campus, causing so much damage there yesterday. And now the cleanup is underway after the tornado overturned cars and a tractor trailer. It also knocked down trees and blew part of a roof off at an apartment complex. The National Weather Service confirming that it was an EF1 tornado that touched down in Coconut Creek. And now residents there are assessing all the damage to their homes. Local 10 News quarterback. And Kennedy is live in Coconut Creek to tell us how the students and the homeowners alike are trying to pick up the pieces today. Ben. Well, good afternoon, Christy and Constance. It has been nonstop raining here. It's been a very busy day. Today's focus has been on cleanup. You can see I'm just surrounded by all this branches and twigs and leaves. This used to be six feet tall, the same height as me. Walk with me for just a bit. You can really still see signs of the tornado. Take a look at this damage. This fence has been knocked down by that tree. It was a noise heard in this Coconut Creek neighborhood as crews picked up and hauled out trees torn down by Wednesday's tornado. I've been through several hurricanes down here, but when you're standing on your back porch and you start seeing trees flying around and when the biggest gust of wind came, I thought it was going to suck my, my sliding door right out of my my kitchen. Cindy Paz's avocado tree is now in pieces, piled up in her front yard after the EF1 tornado touched down with winds up to 100 miles per hour, cutting a path of damage nearly two and a half miles long. The tornado right now. A video posted on Instagram shows a car being turned on the turnpike. Then the twister took aim on Broward College. Something straight out of a movie. It was kind of crazy. Was it believe? I just saw like a lot of tree movement. It was, it was scary. Despite the scary moments, no one got hurt on campus. The safety of our students, faculty, and staff comes first. And that tornado was so strong that it actually ripped that tree from the ground. Take a look. You can actually see the roots here in Coconut Creek. The Red Cross was called out, but again, no one was displaced by this storm. Reporting live in Coconut Creek this afternoon, Ben Kennedy, Local 10 News.